Okay guys, so what we're doing today is we're creating shadows with found objects and we're going to use those shadows to create uh, drawings of different things. So when you put your object down on your piece of paper, you want to make sure that you can create a shadow on the piece of paper. And the best way to do that is to have a single light source on one side of you or behind you. Um, depending on how you cast the light source, you may want to turn on one lamp if you can, or one light. Right now I actually have my kitchen light on and that's what's giving me my light source for this um, assignment. So when I place the object down on my piece of paper, you can see that it creates a shadow right here. And um, I'm able to use that shadow to draw. Okay, that works with any object that I place on the paper in front of me. So if I take another object, there you go. You can see it's creating this really interesting effect over here. I even have light reflecting through the bottle of hand sanitizer. And you can see a really cool effect there that you might be able to use in your drawing. So that's how you create a shadow. You want to make sure that you have a singular light source coming from a uh, side or behind you and that will um, force force the shadow into the opposite direction for you so that you can create a shadow to draw with. 